so at the fourth step of external fertilization in sea archin says that binding of sperm to the egg vitaline envelope sperm acrosome release some proteolytic enzyme that digest the jelly coat and make a path through which siachin sperm enter into the egg vital line envelope and binds to it at the fifth step fusion of sperm and egg cell membrane occur so this is siachin this is siachin sperm cell membrane and this blue is egg cell membrane the fusion of sperm cell membrane and egg cell membrane occur so these are five step that are involved in external fertilization in sea archin we describe each step in detailed manner so first step we discuss that is chemo attraction or you can shortly you can say sperm attraction sperm attraction sea archin sperm attraction so what happened in this step the internal ph so internal ph so internal ph of gonad of sea archin of gonad remains Seven point two because why? Because of high CO two concentration. At this pH. at this ph sperm the sea urchin sperm cannot move next point sperm cell so when sperm cells sperm cells are released in or uh, into sea water so sea urchin sperm cell are released in sea water and resulting resulting in activation activation of which enzyme activation of the, the enzyme or is a motor protein so whatever it is dynein the name of this protein is dynein atps atps means it splits atp due to to high ph high ph of sea water 
that is 7 point senior about 7.6 so at normal pH the dynein ATPase does not active or does not remain in, in its active form but when the sperm are released in seawater a special type of protein or you can say enzyme dynein ATPase activate act leads to activations of dynein ATPase now this dynein ATPase split ATP and provide energy for swimming of sperm so that's this is very important dynein ATPase so dynein ATPase splits what is the role of the dynein ATPase dynein is a type of proto protein dynein and kinesin we discuss it when we enter into the topic of cytoskeleton so dynein ATPase split splits ATP and provides provides energy to to the sperm sea urchin sperm for swimming for swimming but there is a problem sperm cannot show any directional movement towards the egg until resect another type of you can say ligand a small polypeptide binds to it so this is a suppose these are sperm cells these are sperm cells and these sperm cells show a vigorous a continuous movement but until egg jelly so suppose this portion is jelly so sub egg jelly released a special type of a special type of small peptide the name of this peptide is resect consists of 14 amino acid residues now this resect for resect binds with sperm and sperm now sperm shows a particular directional movements towards the egg towards the egg sperm so towards the egg so resect resect binds with the sperm cell membrane and direct the sperm to move in a particular way towards the egg now what is the role of resect we did we dag we understand it with a diagram suppose this is a membrane this is the resect receptor also known as RGC receptor so this is resect receptor and there is lipid bilayer lipid bilayer present now a uh, important channel present that is calcium channel 